Now that I have my sketch lines for where I want my resin, I now need to make those into surfaces. So we're going to extrude a surface. So we're going to go to the extrude feature, but this time we're going to pick surface straight away. We're going to pick the two lines that we drew as our sketch, which now stick up in the air. So we don't want them to go up in the air, we want them to go through our work. So we get our arrow and we drag it down through our work, like so. And we accept. So now we have got our surfaces through our block. Now what we want to do is use our surfaces to split the block into three. To do that, we go to the split tool, split feature here at the top. We pick our block, which is actually here called part one. We pick the whole thing and then we choose entity to split with. We pick that, so we click on it and we pick one of our surfaces. It actually goes like uh, a little bit see-through and that's what we want so we accept our work. And what you see now is the surface has disappeared but left us with a line going through our work. And we now have two parts, part one and part two. So what we want to do next is repeat that process to get three parts. So let's choose the split tool, let's pick the remaining piece which is actually part two. Let's pick our surface and let's accept. So now we have our three parts. Lastly, to finish, just so we can see our three parts in different colors, I'm going to click on this appearance panel and let it pop out. And you see here now we have part one, we have part two, we have part three what we can do is change the colour. If I double click on, let's say, part two and change it to maybe a sandy brown colour, like so, you can see that now part two has become a sandy colour, like a little bit perhaps like wood. So we accept that. Then I click on part one and I double click on the colour. I'll pick the same from the palette or sorry, the same from the palette here, and accept. So now I have what represents two blocks of wood and my resin river going through, all the way through my block. Let's close the appearance panel down. I'll just zoom out. Let's look at our block. And now we're set up, ready to do the next part of the modeling.